In this video, I'm going to show you how to add music to your Movie Maker project. Remember, if you get to the point to add music, that means that you have your title slide, you've split your clips, and your video is completely done other than having music at the beginning and the end. When you are choosing your music, you can only choose music that does not have any words and your music cannot be distracting to the content of your video. So your music should not play on top of people in your video talking. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go to my Google Classroom page. And from this Google Classroom page, I'm going to click on Movie Maker Project Tutorials. And I'm going to scroll down to the bottom where it says Websites for Adding Music. I have two options. I can use Incompetech to add my music or I can convert a YouTube video to MP3. In this video, I will show you how to use both. So we're going to start by using Incompetech. I'm going to click on the link and it takes me to their main page. The nice part about Incompetech is that their music is free to use and all of it is instrumental, so there are no words in their music. So I'm just going to pick a song and then I'm going to play it, make sure I like it. So I'm gonna choose River Fire. I'm gonna hit Listen Out. And you're not gonna be able to hear the video, but I can hear it in, on my computer pause it. I decide I like that song. I want that song for my video. The first thing I always do is get the credits because I don't want to forget to do that. So the nice part about Incompetech is I can copy and paste the credits right under the song right here. So I'm going to do control C copy. I'm going to go into my credits section of my video and I'm going to do control C. There I am good to go. I've given credit for the River Fire song. Now I'm going to go back to this page. I'm going to click download River Fire as an mp3. I'm going to click on the arrow, click show in folder. Then I'm going to drag it into my music. Let go. So I'll check my music, make sure River Fire is there. Yep, it's there. So now I'm going to go back into my Movie Maker project. I'm going to click on home and I'm going to click add music. Once I click Add Music, I'm going to search for my River Fire music. It's right here, and I'm going to click Open. Now, my first immediate problem is that my music is now showing throughout my entire video. And remember, you don't want your music to distract from the content. So I'm actually going to start my video to where I want my music to stop. I'm going to stop it right here. I'm going to go up to Options. I can either split my music or I can set an endpoint. So anything past this line will delete. So I'm going to choose that endpoint, and it deletes everything past that line. So now I have the music in the first part of my video. If I wanted a specific part of my video, let me undo that, or a part of my music. So see how this beginning part doesn't have any music? I can actually stop it here, split it, delete that part by clicking delete, and I can split it here, now notice I'm in the splitting of the music tool. It's really important that you're under music. I can split it here again. And now I can actually pick this up and drag it to the credits. That way the beginning of my video has music and so do my credits, but the rest of my video in the middle does not have any music, so it doesn't distract from the front. So that's one way to add music. I'm good to go. I've given credit for my music and I only have it in parts that do not distract from the content. I can also put it here if I like. Now I want to show you how to convert from YouTube to MP3. So I am going to go back to the internet and I'm going to go on YouTube. And I am going to search a theme song like the NFL theme. Once I click on it, I'm going to hit play. And I'm going to make sure it's a song I like. And once I decide I want this song, I'm going to copy and paste my link into Movie Maker. So let me delete this one because I'm showing you another example. Under credits, I'm going to delete that. And I'm going to say delete, control C, and I'm pasting my YouTube link. Then I have to do a second step with YouTube. I have to go back to this Movie Maker Project Tutorials and click Convert YouTube to MP3. Then I have to Control C, Control V, and hit Convert. 
Once I hit convert, it'll convert this video for me into an MP3. That way I can put it right into my Movie Maker project. I'll hit download. Same process as before. I click here, click show in folder, drag it to my music, let go, go into my project, under add music, choose my song, NFL theme song, click open. So same thing. Now have that song. I can hit key and do the same thing. Edit music set endpoint. I can even add my music in again down here if I want the beginning both times. NFL theme song open. I can pick it up, drag it to the credits, and now I am good to go. So that's two ways to add music into your Movie Maker project. Remember, when you're adding music, do not choose any music with words. And also, make sure your music does not distract from the content.